Hey guys, today what I'm going to be showing you is another video on the iPod on how to change the font on your iPhone, iPod, or iPad. So this is an example right here. Right there, as you can see, it changed the slide to unlock text, the clock, and my banner or carrier up there. So that's today's video. What you want to do is first open up Cydio. And just wait till it loads. Alright, and once you've done that, go on to the Manage tab. Sources. Edit. Add. And you want to add the source called repo. R-E-P-O dot insanely I dot com you probably cannot understand the writing or maybe you can but if you don't it will be on the description down there too or maybe I'll put an annotation here somewhere all right now once you've done that just press add source and just press add anyway but I'm not going to do that since I already have it now once you've done that go on to search and in the search bar type in see better quality here there you go by b i b y T A that's all Vita and then click by the font right there. It's from the Mon My Eye repo. But with why I told you to install the repo dot insane the eye source is to just get more fonts for your iPod. Now there's the CD tweet right there, so all you had to do right hand corner, install and confirm and then go on to your springboard. Then the CD application should look something like this. Right there. By the font. Open that up. And then there it goes. To change the font if you already installed one. Go on to basic. And then in basic what you want to do is just. um, There might be some default themes here. But Kabold is. The one that I installed separately, and to install the theme, all you had to do is just go on to uh, changes, uh, and once they go down, look for fonts, add ons, fonts, and install fonts there. And if you want the theme I have right now, or font, it's called Kabod. Install that on there after respring, it should be on here. And to apply that one, so I'm just going to show you Lansbury for an example. To change it, all you had to do is click the font and press yes. And then it should start respringing right here any second. Here it goes, and that's the separate theme right there. Enter passcode. As you can see, it has like a Halloween theme, I guess. I'm not sure. And it changes the icons or the names of the icons. Focusing. There you go. As you can see there, time. Well, yeah, that's how you change the font on your iPod Touch, iPad, or iPhone using By the Font, which is a free application on Cydia. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. This is Touch Expert signing out.